not enough chairs. Daryl needs a chair. All right, can we talk? <laughs> hey, yeah. I'm just gonna make a seating area out of cushions on the floor. Summer, we need to talk. I can't talk. I have to mash these potatoes. Hand me the cream. No. No more distraction tactics. You and I both know what's going on here. Now these are ruined. I'm going back to the store. You wouldn't happen to have any baking soda, would you? Caitlin, get that dog out of my house right now, or so help me God, I will have it put to sleep. Good. You would, wouldn't you? Caitlin, where are you going? To the Cohen's. They don't hate the whole family, Mom. Just you. Fine. Don't come crying to me when Kirsten's turkey tastes like rubber. Julie. 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 Listen to me. Listen to me. I love you, but you are acting insane. I'm not insane, okay? What's insane is how I used to be, when all I would do was hang out with my best friend and go tanning with her and go shopping and braid her hair and talk to her on the phone. Summer, stop. Let's be honest for a sec. That's what this is all about. Marissa, it's all about her. You gotta stop running away and let yourself grieve. My keys. Stop running away from me. I'm not running away. I just didn't realize how late it was. My dad's probably totally freaking out. I'm sorry I said it. Just please don't go. You're the one who walked away, Neil. You had the affair, remember? Nothing happened with Gloria and me. I told you, I needed somebody to talk to. Well, you can talk to her all you want now. When I get back, I want you out of this house. It's my house. We'll see about that. Bye, Neil. Bye. Hey, it's me. I'm heading back to Providence. Look, everything you said was true, and I need to deal with it, but I need to do it on my own. I am such a mess. It's just... I miss my friend. But I'll call you as soon as I get my head screwed on, okay? I love you. Did you reach him? I left a message. I know I didn't like Seth when I first met him, but I gotta admit he's grown on me. I think you two are gonna be fine. Thanks for seeing me off. It's so crazy to think the next time you come home, I might not be living here. Yeah, are you gonna take that job in Seattle? Well, the offer came at the perfect time. And the hospital is famous for being wonderfully quirky. It's called Seattle Grace. Is the step monster going with you? Well, she'll visit. But we'll take it slow, I promise. I'm really sorry that you and Julie broke up. Yeah, it's not the Thanksgiving that I had in mind. It's too bad, because I think that you and I could both use it, huh? You know, I could take a later flight. Yeah, it's not too late to have Thanksgiving. But you have in mind. <laughs> I love chilies. <laughs> you and me both, Dad.